Hi, this is Chasey with Beyond 20. Today we're going to take a quick look at tables in ServiceNow and just kind of how to navigate the tables and how to identify what table you're on very quickly. Um, so this is within ServiceNow. Um, the first thing we're going to take a look at is just how to identify what table I'm on. So to start with, we will look on incident. And if we look at the URL right in here, right after this F, we can see incident underscore list. This is going to be the actual table name. So if I want to go to that table directly, uh, and I know the table name, I don't want to have to search it using the filter navigator, I just want to go there. I can actually type in incident underscore uh, incident dot list right here, hit enter, and it brings me to that table. And you can see it doesn't contain any of the filters that I had on the open one. It just brings me to the full on table. Let's take a look at one more here. We're going to look at change changes. And up here, once again, we see change underscore request underscore list. So we'll do the, do the same thing, change underscore request and then dot list. So we're changing that last underscore to a dot. And we can see we're directed straight onto it. Now, if I want to open a new tab with that list, instead of using my main tab, say I wanted to have changes and incidents open, I can do pretty much the same thing, except the list is going to be in all capital letters. Once I do that, it opens up that incident list uh, in this new tab that we can see up at the top. So it's just an easy way, if you know your way around your tables, uh, and, and want to get there quickly, you can certainly, oh, I've got my caps lock on, get into that table directly. That's all I've got for today. Thanks and have a great day.